Please don't lag. That is a big thing. Why did two of you jump out at me at the same fucking time? Leave me alone. How many bullets? Good thing for the medipacks over there because I need to heal. Have they lowered the range for the thing? One of them is dead. Looks grim. It's been a brutal fight for these guys. But the tide's turning. Turn up the heat. What a tiny head. My water. It's been a pretty intense fight. Ah, I'm to fuel the med pack. Only have one med gel left. I thought I was a cyborg for a second. General Victus. Okay, so they all died, I guess. General Victus. Yes? I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. A commander. I know who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. Vicarian, where did you go? Heavy Reaper unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my men. Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Fedorian was killed. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. Yeah, that was in, that would have been an awesome background. I'm Primarch of Palavan. Negotiating for the Turian hierarchy. Yes. I've spent my whole life in the military. I'm no diplomat. I hate <laughs> You diplomats. sound perfect, of course. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. See this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Lag again. Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this move. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Look at that. And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed CSEC officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah, I don't know, Garrus. But I'm sure as hell gonna give it my best shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth, I'm- Perfect! Welcome aboard. 
Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could and be taken And how the fuck do I do that? That's a pretty tall order. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan. Yeah. Looks like your summit just got a lot more interesting. Ah, the Krogan. They all agree to help you, Turans and the Solarians. I apologize for being so frank, Commander, but your plan feels doomed to failure. We know. We've been there before. But, Madam Counselor, let me... I'm not the only one that feels this way. The Solarian Dalatras is livid. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Perhaps. Still, we can't help but feel that this summit is a waste of your time. And we can't afford to have it waste ours. We must focus our attention on the arrival of the Reapers. So no, the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. Good luck, Commander. You, that, that basically means uh, boot up your ass and goodbye. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Admiral Hackett. Commander, have you retrieved the Primark for your summit? Yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The time for unity is now. The Solarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us, too. I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Again, I see the graphics are just fucking just astic. There's just nothing this good let's talk to you commander thank you for allowing me the use of your ship and for going along with this plan Garrus said he had to attend to the normandy's weapon systems something about calibrations sounds like Garrus. i'm sorry to say the asari council is the cyanix cannon still in this too game much bad blood otherwise i'm going to be sad she may be right but there'll be a lot more blood real blood if we don't try when you put it that way. The sooner we have this summit, the sooner we'll know. Is there something else I can help no. you with? And I don't really care about what he says at the end. Let's exit through here because we're just boss like that. What? Commander, Edie just went offline. What do you mean, offline? I don't know, she's not responding and I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. Commander, comm systems are going haywire. Whatever's happening is... Okay, deck three, where the crew deck where uh, ED's AI is stationed. Get in here. Why did I go the right way? Like, right. Joker, what's that sound? Fire extinguishers, Commander. Could be an electrical fire or something. Let's see, that robot thing is in there, if I recall. I'm going Just in. Get comfortable on my chair here. Okay, I'm done. Yeah, you, you're not doing shit like that, buddy. Edie, talk to me. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? Edie? Yes. You're in Dr. Eva's the body. Fuck face? Not all of me, but I have control of it. It was not a seamless transition. A transition? You blacked out on us for a while there. Correct. When we brought this unit on board, I began a background process to search for its information on the Prothean device. This eventually triggered a trap. A backup power source and CPU activated, and the unit attempted physical confrontation. Fortunately, I was able to gain root access and repurpose it as I saw fit. During this process, it struggled. 
thus the fire. Edie, you need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done Indeed, this alone. Indeed, you set fire to the ship. Bringing the crew up to speed would have been counterproductive. All attempts to help would have been limited by reaction time. So if you're in there, are you still in the ship? I exist primarily within the ship. For optimal control, this unit should remain within Normandy's broadcast or tight beam range. Are you planning to take that body somewhere? Normandy's weaponry is not suited to every combat situation. This platform could provide limited fire ground support. You mean you could come with us? Correct. This body could accompany you to areas the Normandy cannot reach. Before we do that, I need you to guarantee this mech doesn't have any more surprises in it. Run whatever tests you can, then we can talk about using it in combat situations. One moment. I am running trials. Complete. I can send you a full report if you wish. However, my first step should be restoring functionality to the Normandy, to reassure the crew that all is normal. Just don't be surprised if the crew is a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Joker will also want to see it. On that, we can agree. Okay, so my codex is updated for ED. Tech. Tech. Biotics is the ability no. of rare individuals to manipulate... Weapons, armor, and equipment. No. Although melee combat... Okay, what the fuck? Admiral Stephen. Mm. Cerberus built the Normandy SR2 as a second generation version of the... Uh... I don't know, and I don't really care. Let's get to the bridge, see what um, Joker thinks. She's found something suspicious, apparently, and I didn't pay attention to it. Let's see Joker. We haven't seen him in a while. Well, since the second game. Hey, Commander. Check out my co-pilot. So she installed herself into the new body without any help from you? <laughs> Come on, Commander. Don't you trust me? Okay, let me put it this way. If I knew that Edie was going to install herself into a sexy robot body, do you honestly think I'd be able to keep quiet about it? Look at that! I would have baked a cake. I am right here, Chap. Yes, you are, Edie. Yes, you are. Um... Yeah. Hello, Shepard. Still getting used to greeting people in person? No. I require only one occurrence to adapt to a new concept. How are you adjusting to the arms and legs? I am interested to see how this body performs under real combat conditions, if I could accompany you sometime. Without stress testing, there is no way of knowing if it has serious design oversights. At the moment, it appears... adequate. That's not the word I'd use to describe you. Perhaps we should speak privately. I'll be over here, flying the ship. <laughs> Joker's found himself a girlfriend. What's this about? Does Joker not like your new platform? No, he approves. He wants me on the bridge. He says having me within visual range is important to his morale. Shepard, do you believe your crew members should be allowed to disobey an order on moral grounds? Absolutely. I have no use for team members who can't think for themselves. Why are you asking about something like that? I was designed by Cerberus. I do not take moral stances that conflict with orders from my executive officers. But when Jeff removed my AI shackles, I became capable of self-modifying my core programming. I asked Jeff if he thought I should change anything now that I can. He deflected the question with humor. And you didn't get an answer? Correct. He has repeated this pattern in response to several of my inquiries. Do you think I should make modifications? Only you can really answer that question. That's the point of free will. 
But moral decisions should not be made in a vacuum. If I do not ask the crew for their opinion, I could miss crucial context. May I ask you the questions Jeff avoids? When there is time, will you answer them for me? If you think it'll help, I'll do what I can. Very well. So I will he is uh, adapting to being human-ish. I'm kind of uh, what the fuck right now. Commander, you have a message from Lieutenant Commander Williams. Ah. She must be feeling better. Ashley. No, your bitch. Okay. Well, we know where we're going. The Citadel to visit Ashley? Get out of here. This place is useless. Dead and shit. Plot mass relay jump. Eh, they've captured everything. Get out of my life. Please. What is Earth? I don't say where Earth is. God damn it. Yeah, put me over here. I don't need to see this um, cutscene every time I go It's very fucking loud. I'm not kidding, it's really fucking loud. It burns my ears. Normandy, we are transferring your docking clearance to an Alliance official. Figures. Finally back in action, the Alliance already wants us 